Hi, I'm Billy from Animato. Today we will be discussing the different types of tail pieces and the various ramifications associated with each type. Firstly, we have a wooden tail piece here. And the main downside of these tail pieces is that uh, the fine tuner mechanisms are quite large and heavy and cumbersome. Uh, which is undesirable as this surplus mass can interfere with the vibration of your instrument as you're playing with it. And what this does is it can uh, inhibit the vibration of your instrument, which can slow it down and decrease the volume of the sound of your instrument to an undesirable extent. Secondly, these fine tuners alter the length of the string and what they do is effectively they shorten the length of the string. Um, I'll, sh I'll show you here when we put it next to another tail piece on a full size cello the distance from the ball end of the string to the bridge is actually shortened by slightly more than 10, 10 millimeters, almost 15 millimeters the international standard for, for the distance between the string, end of the string on the tailpiece end and the bridge is supposed to be one sixth of the vibrating string length, which is the length of the string from the bridge to the nut. This can alter the sound of your instrument in an undesirable fashion. Next, we have an alloy or aluminium tailpiece. This is significantly lighter in weight than the wooden tail pieces with the uh, metal fine tuners. Some of the aluminium tail pieces have a tapered uh, fine tuner which, which is tapered at the tip and what this does is it because of its decreased because of the decreased contact in surface area between the tip of the fine tuner and the uh, lever on the tailpiece, uh, this provides much less friction between the uh, tip of the fine tuner and the lever, which can result in a much easier experience while tuning your instrument and can help decrease the risk of uh, your fine tuner getting stuck or getting jammed. We recently received a cello to be repaired and as you can see here, the lever on the fine tuner was not aligned properly and what happened here is the pin from the fine tuner actually came to the side of the lever and totally completely pushed the lever to the side and you can see also here this lever was pushed to the side as well and there is a quite a significant amount of play in this lever which is greatly undesirable. What happens here is as you're tuning your instrument and as you, you tighten or loosen the fine tuner there will be no effect on the pitch of your instrument which is completely useless. Finally we have the carbon fiber tailpiece which is the lightest of these tailpieces and the thread pitch on the fine tuners on these carbon fiber tail pieces is very fine compared to the other ones and what this allows you to do is it gives you maximum precision whilst tuning your instrument uh, because in, the, in these modern times most strings are much more responsive to increases or decreases in tension Lubricating your fine tuners uh, makes it much easier to tune your instrument and also decreases the friction between the threads. This lubrication can significantly prolong the life of your tailpiece.